Hey there, dinosaur fans! Ready to explore the world of carnivorous dinosaurs? These meat-eating giants were the kings and queens of the prehistoric world. From the famous Tyrannosaurus rex to the clever Velociraptor, we're diving into their hunting techniques, diets, and even some epic dinosaur showdowns. So, what makes a dinosaur a carnivore? It's all about their diet. Some hunted in packs, others ruled alone. Carnivores were expert hunters, each with their own strategy for catching prey. Let's check out some fan favorites, the Tyrannosaurus Rex. This iconic predator had a powerful sense of smell and binocular vision, allowing it to track prey over long distances. Its bone-crushing jaws made it one of the most feared dinosaurs. Scientists think that a T-Rex could eat up to 500 pounds of meat in one bite. Next is the Velociraptor. Small but smart, these dinos worked in packs, using their sharp claws to grip prey. Don't let their size fool you. Velociraptors were fierce hunters. Let's start with their teeth. Sharp, serrated, and built to get the job done. Carnivorous dinosaurs had teeth adapted for cutting, gripping, and even crushing. Here are some standout examples. Tyrannosaurus rex. The T-Rex had massive banana-sized teeth with serrated edges, perfect for slicing through flesh and even crushing bone. Its jaws were so powerful, it could gulp down hundreds of pounds of meat in a single bite. Did you know the T-Rex replaced its teeth throughout its life, ensuring it always had a fresh set of deadly weapons? The Allosaurus. Unlike the thick teeth of the T-Rex, Allosaurus had knife-like teeth, narrower and sharper. These were designed to carve through flesh like a saw, making it a deadly predator of the Jurassic period. Spinosaurus teeth were conical, similar to crocodiles, making them excellent for gripping slippery prey like fish. They didn't slice like T-Rex teeth, but worked perfectly for life near the water. The Velociraptor's teeth were smaller but equally deadly, used for puncturing and holding onto prey while its claws did the heavy lifting. The Majungasaurus. This carnivore had stout, rounded teeth that allowed it to crush bones and consume every part of its prey. Talk about efficient. Now let's talk claws, nature's built-in weapons, sharp, hooked, and specialized for hunting. Each carnivore had unique claws suited to its hunting style. The Velociraptor had retractable, sickle-shaped claw on each foot, it was like a grappling hook. This claw could pierce and hold onto prey, making escape almost impossible. The Spinosaurus had long, sharp claws. They could slash and grab fish right out of the water. It also used these claws to fend off land predators. Dinosaurs weren't just fascinating to look at. They were vital to their ecosystems. Carnivores may sound like the villains of the dinosaur world, but they were actually its caretakers. Let's explore how these meat eaters kept everything balanced and thriving. First, they helped control herbivore populations. Imagine a world without carnivores. Herbivores like Triceratops, Stegosaurus and Hadrosaurus would have eaten up all the vegetation. Without plants, the ecosystem would collapse. Carnivores like Tyrannosaurus rex and Allosaurus kept herbivore populations in check, ensuring there was always enough food for everyone. Carnivores also prevented overgrazing. Their presence kept herbivores on the move, giving plants time to grow back. This constant movement helped spread seeds and ensured that different parts of the ecosystem flourished. But what about leftovers from kills? That's where scavenger dinosaurs came in. Smaller carnivores like Compsognathus and even flying reptiles like Pteranodon acted as nature's cleanup crew. They fed on carcasses, ensuring that nothing went to waste and the environment stayed clean, like our modern day vultures, coyotes and other scavengers. Fun fact. The Compsognathus was one of the smallest dinosaurs, but it played a big role in scavenging and pest control. When scavengers finished their meals, the remains decomposed and returned nutrients to the soil. This nutrient recycling helped plants grow stronger and provided food for herbivores. It's a perfectly designed cycle. Carnivores also helped maintain biodiversity by keeping weaker or sick herbivores in check. By targeting the slowest or least healthy prey, predators ensured that herbivore populations stayed strong and resilient. Fun fact. Dinosaur ecosystems were incredibly diverse, with thousands of species of plants and animals coexisting. Without carnivores, ecosystems could fall apart. Herbivores would overpopulate, 
plants would vanish and other animals would struggle to survive. Carnivores back then may have been fearsome, but they were also vital protectors of balance in their world. So next time you think about a T-Rex or Velociraptor, remember they weren't just hunters, they were caretakers, recyclers and essential players in the circle of life. Without them, the prehistoric world wouldn't have been the same. Thanks for joining me on this prehistoric journey. Carnivorous dinosaurs were fierce, fascinating and essential to their world. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share for more dino-sized adventures. See you next time, dinosaur fans.